So we're sitting here in tanker 131 and, and this was our first large fixed wing air tanker that we had purchased. So we bought this airplane in 2011. We refurbished it in 2012 and 13 and it went on contract with the U.S. Forest Service near the end of 2013. And we caught the last few months of that fire season. Yeah, so my name is Matt Ralph. I'm the general manager of aviation with Colson's. I worked here for a number of years as an apprentice. We went away and worked, did a little bit of international work and came back to Colson's uh, on the helicopter side of the, the business. And as they were expanding and growing, moved into the C-130, just making sure that we keep compliant and keep everything on track so the planes can keep going. And going from the helicopter side of the house where your um, helicopter operations on fires are more based around being out close to the fire line, maybe some smaller towns, some smaller areas. Uh, the tanker world is a little more based around bigger airports, obviously, bigger aircraft. So every April we go through what's called a U.S. Forest Service uh, carting procedure and it's where the Forest Service maintenance inspectors come and do a full, very in-depth inspection of, every, of all of our fleet of airplanes. So this year we're sitting in San Bernardino um, and the Forest Service came and have completed Tanker 131, which we're in right now, Tanker 132 and Tanker 133, which are uh, parked right next to this airplane. We got our temporary cards issued so that we can go out and start our U.S. Forest Service pilot carding tomorrow. And um, Tanker 131 will be on contract by the end of the week. All right, so behind me is Tanker 131. So this was our first C-130, and it's a C-130Q slash H model. And it is a, it's ex-military. It started out its life with the Navy TACMO program. Then it went to NASA for a few years and then it was purchased by us and converted into an air tanker. Behind me is tanker 132 and 133 and they are both L382G aircraft so they're longer than tanker 131 and they're commercial derivatives so they're a commercial variant of the military C-130. And our mission is always to provide the pilots with the best aircraft to fly, the best aircraft for the mission, the safest airplane, and the best tanking system to support the firefighters on the ground. And as we've depleted now the world market of C-130 of late model C-130s, we've expanded onto the Boeing 737 Fireliner, which is the first prototype airplane is nearing completion here and will be flying in the next few weeks. And uh, Tanker 137 and likely Tanker 138 and potentially Tanker 139 will join the C-130s next spring during carding for Forest Service for the 2019 fire season.